uh, it hit me that we lost, and it uh, it stinks. But when you get to the tournament, only one team's going to end the season the way they want to, and we didn't. How emotional is this for you right now? And going through this game, the way it ended, and walking off the field. Yeah, it's tough. Um, but I'm proud to, to, to play with these guys. Um, God has blessed me with an ability to throw a football and, and has blessed me to play in, in the greatest um, city in Pittsburgh with the greatest fans and the greatest football team and players. And it has just been truly a, a blessing. And I'm so thankful to him for the, the opportunity that, that he's given me. Can you share what Mahomes said to you and what you said to Mahomes after the game? Uh, you know, I, I just wished him nothing but the best. Um, he's such a good football player, and it's fun to watch him. And, um, you know, just just a lot of respect there, I think, between us. How about what he said to you? Um, uh, you know, he just respect a lot of respect and, and said he's got to get a jersey, and I told him I need one too. And do you feel that this offense made progress over the course of the season, collectively and individually in the house? I'm... I'm you know, it's it's hard to answer that right now. I, I'm I will say that I'm really proud of the way guys fought. Um, we had guys, whether it's linemen or backs or receivers, tight ends. I mean, guys stepped up and and literally fought to the end. Um, tonight, uh, you know, guys just just never quit and literally to the last second, even when it's you know it's out of the, out of grasp. Guys don't quit and we're line changing receivers and we're just fighting and linemen are fighting their butts off. And so I'm just so proud to to call these guys brothers and to play for them. Demo, there's some disconnects there, maybe more so than before, especially early in the game. It seemed like a couple times you audibled or, or changed the play and threw the ball deep or threw it out and guys kind of stopped or, or... Well, we, you know, I don't think any of us played well early. You know, I think we, we all, um, for whatever reason, you know, and, and so we didn't make the plays we had to early um, to, to give ourselves a chance. And... By doing that, we didn't keep our defense off the field. We put them in tough situations to go against such a high-powered offense when we don't, you know, do our job and stay on the field and convert third downs and stuff. That's that's tough. And you guys dealt with a lot of adversity this season. How do you sum up what this team is able to accomplish this year? You know, just a bunch of guys that fought for each other, um, that fought their butts off, and um, you know, just competed. It wasn't wasn't always pretty, but there were a lot of games that we found a way. And, and like I said, just like tonight, fought to the end. And I'll just, uh, just say that I'm so proud of, of this group of men and the way they fight and, um, for each other, for, for the black and gold, for our fans. And, and so um, it's just been an honor to, to play with them. And what impact do you think you had on this franchise? I, I don't know. I mean, I've been here a long time. Um, and it's been a lot of fun. Like I said, God has blessed me. Um, you know, we, we joke a lot, you know, about the Browns and then going there, but it was it was meant to be that I was going to wear black and gold. Um, draft day, I had a black suit on with a gold tie. I mean, um, I, I'm just I'm just so thankful. I, I hope that that I'm able to pass the legacy of what it is to be a Steeler um, from check out Dan Rooney, you know, and so. We we all miss him. Anyone that knew him misses him, and so it's just um, hopefully I could pass some of that on to some of the guys, and it can continue the, the tradition of what it means to be a Steeler and get passed down. Is that important to you this year? Did you try to do that more to pass that legacy? To yeah, I mean not just this year, but but whenever you get a bunch of new guys, once you start to lose some of the the, the old regime, if you will, you got to find ways to pass it down. And we've got some guys in there that will continue to do that. You know, I gave Cam a big hug and and told him it's on him now. It's his, it's his job to pass it down and to to keep teaching and, um, and and holding guys to the to the Pittsburgh standard. Is this, is this harder than you thought it would be, playing in the last game? Um, yeah, I mean, we, shoot, we, we thought last week was going to be the end. You know, we didn't, we didn't know what was going to happen. And um, got blessed to play another football game. And um, it didn't end the way we wanted it to. But um, it, it's, it's a blessing to be able to play this game. I mean, we – and I try and tell those guys um, a lot that we – how lucky are we that we get to play football for a, for a living? Um, we need to, to count our blessings and understand how, how lucky we are. Yeah, we're out there getting beat up and this, that, and the other, but we get to, to entertain millions of fans and, and throw, catch, run, do, do what we've all done as, as kids. That's our job now. And it's just um, we need to, when we say our prayers, thank God for that.
couple more. And how much over the years, I mean, you've seen a lot of teammates go through the, the end of their career phase. How much has this point been something you've thought about happening eventually? And maybe how did the way this played out, how you thought it might or different? Or Yeah, I don't know if it's, if it's emotional because it's, just the end of the season. I mean, this would be emotional no matter what. It's, you know, we, we never like to lose and go out and I'll miss these guys. Um, it'll probably really hit me um, come training camp time. What's next for you, Ben? I'm sorry? What's next for you? You know, I'm going to do everything I can to um, to be the best husband and, and father I can be and, and try and expand um, um, God's kingdom. One are more. Ex- are you excited for that phase of your life? Uh, I'm nervous. <laughs> uh, no, I am excited um, just because